In this session, let us understand what are joint products and byproducts. Let's take oil industry for example. Here you can see products like gasoline, fuel oil, lubricants, paraffin, coal tar, kerosene. All these products are produced from crude petroleum. What is significant here is all these products have equal importance. They are simultaneously produced from same process. Each of these products have significant sale value and you cannot designate one single product as major product. If this is the nature of products produced, then we call them as joint products. Let's look at the definition of joint products. It is two or more products separated in the course of same processing operation, usually requiring further processing. Each product being in such proportion that no single product can be designated as major product and that's what we call as joint products. Okay, then what are byproducts? Have a look at molasses. You get this when you manufacture sugar, ammonia and benzoyl. You get all those when you carbonize coal, glycerin. You get this when you manufacture soap. So when we say byproduct, they're all products which you get from either the material discarded in the main process or these are all products which are produced from the scrap or waste materials in the process or these are all the products which emerge from the processing operation of another product. That is, you will get them when you produce some major products and these materials will get their value only at the time of separation from the main product. Okay, so byproducts are basically secondary product or subsidiary product we can say and they emerge, they arise because of manufacture of main product and we have to segregate this byproduct from main product at a particular point, right? Okay, that point is what we call a split off point. Okay, so till that split off point, all expenses of processing will be joint and post which it will be segregated. At this juncture, let us also appreciate the difference between joint product and byproducts. See, all joint products have equal importance. Whereas byproducts will have very small economic value. Next, if you look at the production side, joint products are produced simultaneously, whereas by byproducts production are incidental. That is, we can say they are in addition to main product.